Okay, people, hello, welcome back. Now, last time we just stopped here with repairing our fleet. And what I want to do now is take at least at this island here as well, since the cooldown just ran off. We can do that. And perhaps even this one here. There's almost no defense here, so we could actually try and take it. Um, my goal is to, to weaken him so much that there is no chance of him to recover again for the next... Um, couple of hours so let's do that and I have a very nice fleet here in the new world let's have a look back real quick at the old world I'm building up another fleet here but as usual this takes a bit of time because those ships take a lot of time and there is his fleet kind of and he's trying to take this small island here and he's going to succeed but I don't care that much no it's a weak island so that's okay and another thing that we just wanted to do in the last episode is an have another pier here because we have quite the queue, the waiting line. So let's have another queue here. Ah, queue I say. A pier where my people or my ships can dock. So like that. That should be a nice addition to that. And also one more thing is that... Ah, this is annoying. One of his big ships is attacking me. And look how fast they are. So that is unreal from time to time. And he's attacking now the back of my island. Uh, my main island. Let's, let's get another... Well... Frigate. This is not good. I mean, his, his fleet is not so strong, but I just don't have anything else here. I think I have got these ones. And since I have... Oh, yeah, I do have a defense here, so let's destroy him. And I promise you this will be the last war that we see in a while, because I'm going to crush him. Sorry for that. Let's go back to the new world. Attention Our fleet is there. Let's attack this harbor here. There's no ship close by that could interfere. Let's take it here in the new world. Let's go back to the old world while this is happening. And form my fleet. As far as I can tell, he's coming in now from the side. So let's take our fleet and destroy him. Hopefully my ships are fast enough. Yep, they're already on their way. We have good winds. Your is under attack. And there his fleet comes up. Your enemy's resistance in and we've taken the another, another island here. Very nice. And now we can destroy this fleet here as well. Hopefully. Another bigger battle here. I'm going to lose one of my ships now, I think, yeah. Phew, close one, I haven't lost it. Let's bring this one back real quick to my harbor. I don't know why his military is still supposed to be stronger than mine, because I can't see more ships of him. And he is really bad at, at, at war stuff, so. so... That is a nice fleet here. Look at that, he's sending it right into my fleet again. And we're sailing against the wind, so we definitely have the disadvantage here. One of your 
Oh boy, is this game stressful in the later game now. And we are still at store stage 4 with no progress really to get to the next stage. Let's destroy him there now. Because he's trapped I think, or? Or is he just pretending to be trapped? No idea. I'm going to leave him now because I need to defend my island. That's more important. Okay, and I also have more ships ready. Let's go to the new world. Let's see what happened here. So we got this island now as well. And we still have a, a huge fleet here. So what I can do... I can take one of his big ones. That one, for example. So there is his harbor, rather small. And with lots of buildings that are definitely important to him. And I still can't repair my buildings as long as it's under siege. Another 20 minutes or so. So we need to wait for on that. And what we need to do first is we need to destroy his, our defenses here. Well, let's just attack his. Let's just attack this building right away because he's losing so much morale rather quickly. And that's the end of him. Very nice. Whew. And I'm also going to conquer this island here, and all of his buildings just disappeared. And once again, for my defense, he started the war. There is one of his more powerful ships coming. So I'm just going to destroy it. I don't know if it's still trying to help. And there is his real harbor with some very hard defenses. Got a huge range, those ships there. Your harbor is under attack. Okay, so the siege here is over, so I can just repair those buildings again. And with that fleet, we can definitely take or try to take one of his bigger islands. And one thing, so that we have some progress, is what I wanted to show is that we can still upgrade our harbor here by one more step that increases the storage. Looking more beautiful now. And we've also got more storage for that. Look at that, he's just attacking me with one gunboat. That is, this is pure harassment. To have the frigate and the ship of the line. And I've got my bigger fleet here. Let's go to the new world again. Let's have a real quick look. There are my ships here. Ceasefire has ended. Yep, let's take this harbor here. There's nothing else I can do really. So he still doesn't want to, to go at peace with me, I think. A check copy? Especially good humor, Governor. It's important to be true to oneself. Let's try. Let's try to get some war uh, some peace here. But chance of su success is zero, which doesn't make sense to me because he lost so much and he's at a, a clear disadvantage. So even if I request a ceasefire, he doesn't accept it. Or a peace treaty. Nope, still doesn't like that. 
we could flatter him a bit, you know, so, well, he likes us like at 2% or something, I don't know. And of course what I also need to do is, I don't have any ships here now, that is something I should do, is, I should, wait a second, let, let me get, what I should do is I reinforce the harbors that I've already gotten, the islands. The fire left ruins behind. Your harbor is under attack. And I need to check my goods as well, of course. I do have enough schnapps again, that is good to know. Um, Fishes is going down though, so we need to fo focus on that. And the rest is still looking good. Bread a bit, as usual. So we have to increase our production here. What do we have? So we have the soap from the pig farms. I think we have quite a lot of pigs here. Yeah. So let's just bring back some normality here. Even though it, we're still at war. But I want to focus more on my economy. Let's have some rendering works here. And then I can have like two more soap factories. How much soap do we have here? Oh, we are full on soap anyway. So I think it's just a matter of charter routes that we don't have enough. We have one here. And we really just have one soap charter route. So that is probably the problem. And let's get another 80 tons of soap to Sleepy Hollow. Let's send my two uh, frigates to that place here, because they're fast. Never mind me saying that. Okay. They're definitely taking their time. And what I want to do is, of course, get more big ships here. I want to take one of his harbors. He doesn't want to take peace with me, so I think I need to really destroy him until the very last island. This island here, though, has, has such a huge defense, it's impossible, really. But the other ones should be possible. That's that. And let's go back to the new walls. See what's happening here. My fleet is down here now. So let's take on his island here. And at this point it just doesn't make sense anymore that it doesn't want any peace with me. Even if I offer it with no demands. Damn it, I think I'm losing my ship here. Nope, that was close. Okay, so that was another of his islands and he's lost another production. And that is still his main island, so... I don't know how long it takes to crush his morale. There's some more sickness here, let's mobilize. And we have enough workforce here on this island. Let's have a look, we have enough fish. Oh, fish! Good, good no. Good word. There was something about the fish, right? Fish should definitely not reach zero. I think it was just going down because he was attacking my island here and especially my fisheries, which are down now to zero. So it's already stabilizing again, but we need to repair them once the the timer is out up in two minutes. And I should never forget really to put on the regular speed again. I'm always too fast. So, bread and... well, soap shouldn't be a problem, really. Let's have another soap. Charter route. And also one bread. Your people are healthy again. Oh, I can't. I don't have enough influence. So I need to wait to get more influence again. So our influence is now at plus 10. Hmm. 
I need to increase my influence though. I'm at a 410. I hope that this goes up though. It would be bad if not. Yeah, I'm losing my, my big ship here now. I don't know, they should have defended it, but they were just stuck here somewhere over there. That was bad. Or, have I not lost it yet? Look at that. It's barely alive. Trying to survive somehow. It has like four health points left. Where's the rest of my fleet? There it is. They're just standing around. This is a, an annoying bug though, because I'm sending those ships to harbor and they just stand still. So now I'm going to send them again to La Isla and let's hope they go now this time. Yeah. Or? These people, they need it seems like they don't want to go, right? This one here. Now it goes. Okay. Now it sails. Did they get to you? That should be okay. Right. So we've done all we can, and it, it looks like we we can save this one here. It's surrounded by pirates, but they shouldn't attack me. And that's a clipper, right? Yeah. So that's not going to hurt us. So I think we're going to save this one. That would be amazing. I don't want to lose such a big ship. Attention for the Admiral. Okay, so we have my fleet here and some more here. Let's, let's merge them. And in the meantime, focus on the soap that we have here. Going to upgrade more of my warehouses here and then we can also have some more of those rendering works oh they need steel okay that's okay and let's have a look at the bread the bread doesn't need any steel so that's good for us let's reinforce that as well let's have some more grain farms here let's say four Four more means um, two more windmills here and four more bakeries here. Okay, and we also need another warehouse for that, which we can upgrade. Very nice. Let's also have one here and here. Quite the green fields here. But not so much if you consider that this is enough to feed 20,000 people. Over here. Right, so the siege should be ended. Yeah, the siege has ended so we can repair our fisheries. They're working again and let's build some more here. With another warehouse. We need more of those fishes. He's getting the schnapps, but one, I don't think that one is enough to... Where's my schnapps? Oh, there it is. It is enough, but only because we're limited to that. So let's have a depot. Only because we're limited to 70 tons. Let's add another 50. Another 100, perhaps. Yeah, another 100 tons of storage.
That should be enough. So let's hope that this is enough for everything now. Yeah, and we need another warehouse here. That is not a good planning on my side. We need just uh, a few more tons of timber here so we can upgrade the warehouses because they are quite overloaded as you can see. And I think that's all we can do for now. We have enough bread now as well and the soap should be up there as well. Yeah, it is. So we have enough, yeah, fish is going up again. We have enough schnapps, perfect. And the bread and soap should be going up as well. Let's have a look at the other things. Canned food is going down, but we have enough steel, right? No, we don't. Okay, more steel would be another op uh, thing on our priority list. And we don't have enough fur for the fur coats. And the sewing machines is going down as well, which needs steel. Steel and what else? I don't have all I Endless ratty ties. There it is. It so that is the first that we need and sewing machines looking good though. Steel is missing, that's all. And I know why, because we are producing so many weapons here. That it consumes a lot of, of steel, so let's let's put two of them to sleep for now. And the thing is, I'm, r I'm running out of, of iron as well. So all my iron mines are being used now. There is still one more. Perfect. So we can still use this one here. And I think we have enough coal here anyway, right? Yeah, we do have some coal here. Let's just build another coal mine over here. And then we can have a coal mine here. Okay, and then we can have a furnace with that. I think two. Yeah, we can have two furnaces here. And then, of course, have another charter route. Yeah, okay, we can't have any more shadow rods because of insufficient influence. That is a problem. And that could become a problem soon. One of our ships is under attack. Where? Oh yeah, here in the new world. Has the other one made it? Yes, the other one made it to La Isla. Beautiful. That is really good to know. I was worried that worried there for a second. Attention. And I don't know why they are so slow. They're not even damaged or something. But it doesn't matter. Soon we're going to capture this one here and put an end to his to his, I don't know, existence in the new world. He still got some islands down here, but they're all very weak and small compared to the big one here. Right, that is that. It's gotten a bit quieter again, so I think he's not going to, to produce that many ships anymore. Or he's not able to. He's got one more here. But I don't see anything else on the map. That is a frigate, so that is a bit more of a fighter. But that's it. That's it for now. He's got quite the city here, though. With those courtyards that you can see in, in Berlin or something, or Vienna building like that okay so we've we are a bit more at peace again I can focus more on my production and our influence of workforce course shortage. so we need more uh, workforce more workforce and more influence workforce points shortage. Yes, yes, I'm, I'm building already. So, a few more of them. And we can also downgrade one or two workers. 
so that we are good on good terms again. And I think I need to, well, say goodbye to the idea of the achievement because I definitely need lots and lots of more charter routes before I can reach investors. And the problem is I don't have any more islands. So, and I already have too many charter routes. So I need ships now, real ships, my ships for the trading routes. Otherwise I can't um, supply my, my city anymore or I, I can't see any way for that. So we need to build some ships for that. And I think for the smaller routes here, a good way um, are the clippers. So let's build some clippers. Let's say two here. And on my second shipyard, two more. I can only build one for now. Ah, yeah, because I'm, I'm low on influence. So we need to focus more on those. And the advantage of that is it's cheaper than the charter rods, I think. Where are my clippers? There is one. No, those clippers are more expensive than the charter rods, I think. But it doesn't matter. We need to we need to use them. And schooners. We could also have some schooners here. So and by the way, these are not the only ships that we of course can build. So there's still the steam shipyard where we can build steamships. They're going to be more interesting once we have electricity and oil, especially oil. We have the oil fields here and we have the oil refinery. So we, we could every, actually we could start with that and start with electricity and electricity. That's a nice thing. So I did kind of plan for that. Um, if you have factories here, you can boost them with electricity. So I have factories here close by and here and then I can just build a oil power plant like this one here and boost all the buildings that are in the vicinity of it and boost their production so that is very important and I think it's long overdue that we do that so that is the next goal for the next episode we finally start with the oil refinery and the railways very excited for that stay tuned <laughs>